Hey guys, DJ here at Top 10 Cards and Games, and today I'm going to crack open some of the new Megatins. Uh, hopefully you guys can hear me okay, it's, we're moving stuff around in the store, it's a little bit noisy, so I'm in a different room. Um, but it shouldn't be too big of a deal, I'm going to crack open the Odd Eyes tin first. Uh, for those of you who aren't familiar with the Megatins, they're a reprint tin, just full of cards from the last, basically, year. Uh, they have some sweet promos on the top. First off, we have the cool... Promo Odd Eyes, which looks really sweet. Uh, guaranteed Super Rare Majesty Fiend, which is again, really cool. And the most important card from these tins, Elder Entity Norden. Uh, Norden is a fusion monster. You guys take a look at him. Uh, you can summon him by fusing a Synchro or an XYZ with another Synchro or XYZ. And then when it is special summoned, you get to target a level four or lower monster in your graveyard, special summon it, and its effects are negated. You also banish it when Norden leaves the field. Uh, that means you get instant fusion for it also. So you get this level 4 guy with 2000 attack and 2200 fence, and you get the special summon guy from your graveyard, which is insane. These things are a little bigger than normal, by the way. Uh, you can get this out here. It's a nice big tin to put stuff in. And they come with three of these mega packs. Mega packs are 16 cards each. Just crack one open, and you get a lot of cool stuff in here. So we have our wealth of commons. Then we have some rares and some foils. Ooh, got some sweet stuff in this one. Got a Caduceus, got a Harmadick, a Forbidden Dress, and, or not Forbidden Dress, but it's Forbidden Scripture. Forbidden Scripture, yeah. And a Berry and Hope. And then just some more commas in this one. So you get a Super, a Secret, and an Ultra in each pack, along with the rare. Pretty sweet stuff. Uh, definitely worth the value, especially if you're just looking for cards from the last year or so. I'm not going to go through all the commons again. We got Fright for Bear. Ooh, Zaborg the Mega Monarch. Dante and Big C. If you're looking to build Burning Abyss, this is a great opportunity. These Dantes are going to be much easier to get your hands on than the old ones. Uh, there are like a million cards in here, so it's not exactly super likely to get whatever you're looking for, but I mean, already just out of one, I have a Hermetic and a, a Dante. That's just awesome. And last pack. Commons, we got Galaxy Eyes Photon, Nefshadol Fusion, and Karen Morgan. All of those cards are sweet. So, I mean, that's just out of 110. I have all this stuff, plus my uh, Majesty's Fiend, if I didn't have that, that's incredibly good value. Uh, and the Norton, this thing was just awesome. <coughs> Definitely a sweet product if you're trying to get in. Uh, there's a ton of space in the tin to put your cards back in. I don't know why I threw mine over here. I know we're going to open the other tin, though, the Rebellion Dragon one. And get the freaking. Oh, there we go. Same thing with the, the cool different rarity promo. I don't know what these are called. Uh, Rebellion Dragon is a little bit better than Odd Eyes, so I mean, this is just really sweet to have. If you guys want to take a look at it, it's really cool. Uh, then this one also comes with like Estelle, which is another great reprint that if you didn't have, you definitely should be looking to get one. And the other, <coughs> excuse me, the other new card is Elder Entity Hastor. Hastor is a level four synchro. Uh, it takes a tuner and a tuner, or a tuner and a non-tuner. Sorry. Uh, this card is sent from the monster zone to the graveyard. You can target one face of monster your opponent controls. Equip this card. Excuse me. <laughs> From your graveyard to that monster, if that monster can't attack, its effects are negated, and if this card leaves the field uh, while equipped to your opponent's monster, you get to take control of the card it was equipped to. So it's a generic level 4 that does really, really good stuff. Uh, so there's a lot of reasons to jam that in if you can make level 4s. So it's probably better than like playing an army arm or something. It's just a really cool effect. And it's got a decent body with 2300 attack. Let's get into here. So we got Dance Princess. Another Harmon deck, Scripture, and Artifact Site. It's going to make Inferno as much easier for me to put together. Next pack, Necros Cycles are rare, then Metaphys Forest, Necros of Gunner, and Herald of Arclight. This is just Necros the box. <laughs> there are not very many cards for Necros in these sets. We opened all of them. Then in this one, we got Altair, Eye of the Void, Magical Spring, and Taltai. So, I mean, still some really awesome stuff in this one. Uh, definitely the most exciting thing to me is that we got 
two armor decks, which is just great towards building burning of this, plus all our new promos. Uh, Dante as well, just a ton of awesome stuff. And if you just want to look at this from like a value perspective, these cards are certainly worth the price of buying the tens. So I definitely recommend you guys that are looking for cards from the last year or so that don't have them, go check them out. Uh, if you're just waiting to get some of the older cards that you haven't had a chance to get yet, they'll definitely be a little bit cheaper and easier to get your hands on now. So just a win for everyone. These tins are absolutely awesome. Uh, we have them in stock now at the store if you guys are from the area. So feel free to come check them out. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching.